hello guys welcome back so now we are going to implement the push notification service so for that purpose uh, right click on lib new let's create new folder we will give it name as uh, push notifications push notification system right click on this push notification system folder dot file let's create push notification system now for the push notification system you already know that we are using firebase messaging firebase cloud messaging so let's start implementing our push notification system let's create an instance of our firebase messaging the first thing that we will implement is when the notifications arrived when the notification arrived or received so we can give it name as when notification received so whenever a notification is received on the phone there are three things uh, three you can say three scenarios for a notification when received either it is terminated that is when the app is completely closed and open directly from the push notification okay let's say you are using that app and you close that application so the first case is when the app is terminated that is when the app is completely closed then in that case when a notification received what we will do of course we will implement it now the second thing is foreground when the notification is received in the foreground foreground simply means that when the app is open and it receive a push notification then we have the third and last step that is the background now background means when the app is in the background and open directly from the push notification when the user tap on it okay so let's implement it now step by step so for the terminated that is when the app is completely closed for that we have get initialize message and that is the remote message and first we check if the remote message not equals to null that is if the remote message is available successfully that is the things which we receive in a notification then what we will do we will simply open app when the user tap on that notification okay so we will open app and show notification data so here we will call the method of course which we will implement now which is show notification or you can just say show notification uh, show notification data when open app that is we received the app is terminated and we receive a push notification the user tap on that push notification so what we will do if the remote message is not equals to null then simply open up the app and show that notification data so the best thing will be we can give it name right like this okay that is open app and show notification data 
Now to this method we will pass some information which we will receive in a push notification while sending we will send this data and please use the same keys ok user id and the next thing is the sender id so these two things that is user id and sender id we will pass whenever we send a notification so please use the same keys okay otherwise later you will forget about it and you will use different key while sending the notification so then you will not get exact data in a push notification so anyways this was the terminator uh, when the app is completely closed also let's implement this method down here so as I told you this one is basically the for user ID that is to which user we want to display that this notification so you can say receiver ID that is this user ID we pass to this method as a parameter and it is receiving inside this receiver ID variable then we have the sender ID that is from which user it came so we can say sender ID is the second parameter and third one is the context okay let's refactor this and this is show open app open app open app and show notification data okay open app and show notification data method so anyways this method we will implement completely in the next part in the next video for now let's complete these three conditions so this was the terminated then the second one firebase messaging dot instance dot for the foreground we have to listen to the message so on message dot listen as you know that in the foreground the app is open okay so we have to listen for the push notification that is on message dot listen and the same if condition we can add here now then comes the background so we can say firebase messaging dot on message opened app not listen so these are the three conditions or you can say three ways when the notification received when the app is terminated when the app is in the foreground and when the app is in the background